it's just, I mean, it's it's hard, you know. Um, for filming, especially as a medium, is very and stop motion in general is very time consuming. And when you're doing that as one person, that requires a lot of drive. And sometimes you just don't have that drive, especially when you work on the same project for literally months on end. Literally, you know, it, it's just it, it's it is difficult to stay motivated, but. I don't know what I like. I haven't done anything for the past five weeks except for build a set, and sometimes you just gotta take a break, you know. You just gotta take yep. a break and then come back to it and be like, "Here's a video," and then people are like, "Oh, it's great, thanks," you know. Um, yeah. With I mean, it's, with when you have more popularity, then I think that helps with motivation. But when you're in the lower range, like less than 20,000, less than 15,000 subscribers, 20,000 subscribers, anything below that, you know, and you're not necessarily uh, making a whole lot from it in terms of like, um, kind of, you know, attention, you know, even though it sounds kind of like bad, like, oh, attention whores, right? Or attention hogs. Um, and there isn't uh, you know, not necessarily as much interaction as you'd like, not necessarily as much money as you'd like to make to, uh, to be substantial enough to purchase and uh, justify this hobby. Once you get to 100,000 subscribers, then that really, I think, validates it. Uh, that's, when you get the, that's when you get something physical for it. You get the play button on YouTube. Um, and this is also, this is from a YouTube standpoint of things as well. Um, if you have, if you're not really into the whole YouTube game, quote unquote, because it is, it is a game really about like manipulation of statistics and trends and all that stuff and tags and, um, viewer retention and all that. What was the point I was making? I don't know. I, I just kept like going into deeper, deeper holes. Um, but yeah, once you get to a hundred thousand subscribers, then you get something physical that validates it. Um, if you don't have something like in your hands, it can be it can be difficult. Or like if you get a substantial amount of money, it can be difficult to uh, justify what you're doing, right? Because you know, from a purely materialistic standpoint of view, you you get nothing from it. You get some money maybe, um, but other than that, uh, and a lot of the time you won't be getting a lot of money. Um, this was a big. That was a big, that was a big rambling point, but uh, <laughs> yeah, it it does it does get hard.